Hey, guys. You behind me, you'll just see a light, and that's where Karula is and with Taxon. So Karula is about 50 meters from the tent. See, Dave, we don't need to leave the tent to find animals. Amazing. Oh, Taxon's off-roading. Is Karula coming towards us? Sneak. No, I'm joking. She's quite relaxed. I'm just trying to see if we can spot her. Oh, I'm still, I'm still listening, playing Evil Man, and listening to the game drive radio. Turn that down. Now, I'm going to ask Tax now. Tax, um, I'm in the tent. Is Krula heading towards me? Let's see what Taxon says. Joking, you there. Joking. Them <laughs> Taxon says she's stalking me. I'm joking. She's on the road, so the road's probably about 30 meters from us. Krula wouldn't stalk me. Maybe she would. No, unlikely. So the interesting thing about leopards is, uh, in other parts of the world, human beings form uh, a very... She just crossed to the northern side of the... Um, sure, northern side. Northern side, so she is coming towards us. So the interesting thing is about leopards in certain parts of the world, human beings for, form a very important diet, and we can chat about that a little bit later. But in, in, in Africa, human beings... Wait, come, Dave, come. She's coming towards us. Isn't this exciting? See the spotlight? Oh, there we go, she's coming directly to the tent. people chance. standing out there. Uh, Jamie, can you let them to go inside? Rex, I, I've got comms with you. Um, we're standing at the entrance. She's coming directly to you then. Okay, we're gonna move, uh, move back. Dave, do you want me to cable bash for you? No, it's all right. It's okay. So we're gonna stand here. She's going to come right to us. I think this will be the first leopard in the tent. Okay, so watch the spotlight. Look, 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 she's after an Inyala. Do we go over here to get a kill from the tent? There's a baby Inyala right next to the tent. Are we going to get a leopard kill without even leaving camp? There she is, there she is, there she is. Rexy, there's a Mampimpan. Inyala just next to us. Do you see her? There we go. We've got the first leopard in the tent. She's coming right towards us. She's completely ignoring us. There's a baby Inyala just to the, probably about 50 meters away from her. And it sounds like Rex and stuck. It, it's very difficult driving at the moment. Morning, Queen. Hello, cruel skis. <laughs> Um, I don't, I don't want to boast, but ladies, we're your big cats. <laughs> so Jamie is on her way here. But look at this, we are in the tent. We haven't even left camp, and we have got Karula, the queen of Juma. Now, there's an Inyala about 50 meters in front of her. And then Yala's run away. But not far away. I don't think it's gone too far. Isn't this exciting? And I don't know if you guys heard Rexon on the radio. He says, ah, Karula likes Brent. She's heading to the tent. And it rhymes. Dave, she also likes you. It's okay. We've been waiting for this to happen. We've had a, a few chats in the tent about the day we get a big cat from the tent. And there we go. Um, she's 15 meters from us. Uh, what's that in feet? 30 feet? Diane is wondering who are Rexon and Taxon. They are safari guides that work for Juma. So they drive the guests that come stay in the lodge. And uh, Rexon also works on our bushwalk team. Uh, as as one of our security detail. So she is looking directly towards where that little Inyala is. So that Inyala, okay. little Inyala, I think, has moved into a thicket and it's just laying down. I don't see an adult around it. So very, very interesting. Look at her. Hello. Hello, Queenie. Michael's wondering, why is Krula so relaxed on foot? 
in comparison to maybe Shadow. Well, Shadow is actually quite relaxed on foot. Shadow just operates in an area where we don't walk as much. Um, it's a difficult, difficult question to answer, it, and it comes down to individual personalities. Certain leopards are more relaxed on foot than others. For example, if we take male leopards, quarantine is much easily, much more easily approachable on foot than Tingana. But we can find them all. There we go. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? And you can see Krula is nonplussed about our presence. She's still looking towards where that little Inyara ran off. I'm sorry, Dave. I might just walk across your frame for a second. I just want to see if I can spot that Inyara. So I'm trying to see if I can see the Inyara. The Nyala was just in front of the tent. Oh, she's on the move. She's coming towards us again. Jamie, come around towards Candace's house and go along the power lines. So I'm just letting Jamie know where she's going. Look how cool this is, guys. A leopard from the tent. I don't even have to go on game drive to find big cats. Well, Taxi found it for us, but, or Rexy, actually. Can you see her? She's, a, she's probably even closer. She's probably about 10 meters, for, 10, 12 meters from us. Look, 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 there she is. It's a pity we don't have a longer cable in the tent, otherwise we could follow her, Dave. Sure. Maybe we should get the bushwalk back like. <laughs> This is so exciting. I think this is the first big cat from the tent, Dave. That's right. Well, you know, I don't need to track cats. They come to me. It's the truth. I can't lie. OK, well, we're just going to move out a bit so we can see if we can stay with her as long as our cable lets us. She's heading, I think she's heading slightly more to the west. Sorry, Jamie, um, it looks like she's heading slightly more to the west. I'd say power lines from Gallagher Shortcut. She's changed direction slightly. So I'm just letting Jamie know. I thought she was going to pop out right next to the DRC, but it looks like she's going to go through the drainage line. So the best way is to go around. So we've lost sight of her. <laughs> How exciting. Tent team, one leopard. Game drive teams. Zero. Now we just need the Inkumas to come for a visit. 